everyone. This is Jose Casillas, one-fifth of the band Incubus. Uh, welcome to my home here on stage. And I'm here to give you a little tour of my setup, what I use, why I use it, and uh, what it looks like. Um, obviously, as you can see, I play a drum workshop, DW drums. Um, these are my new ones. They're clear, they're acrylic. Um, with cool hardware. Um, I didn't want anything too flashy, so I popped it for this look. The sizes I play, um, I play an Octobon 6 inch. Um, as far as toms, I play an 8, 10, 12, 16, 18. Um, for my rack toms, I play the fast stack or short stack toms, fast toms, whatever you want to call them. Um, I'm a short little Mexican guy, so I like to sit low. Um, so these enable me to um, bring everything down without having to raise my snare up. Um, if you look at my snare, you can see it's sort of tilted downward too. So I um, so I can get more of a uh, rim shot without bringing it up. Um, but yeah, most people who sit on my kit are kind of shocked at how low I'm sitting. But yeah, so the so the short stack toms enable me to, to sit pretty low. The reason why I sit so low is because I need I want my uh, my legs to sort of be at a horizontal um, state when I'm sitting. I sit on my butt um, and keep my legs up for the most part. So to have a good equilibrium and a good balance, stable balance, um, that's the height I sit at. So uh, anyways, um, yeah, so uh, those are the sizes. I play a 20 inch kick drum. Again, a smaller, smaller uh, kick drum um, still sounds enormous. Um, as far as cymbals, I play uh, Sabian cymbals. I've been playing them for uh, maybe, I don't know, a decade or so now. Um, they make great cymbals. I have a, I have a pretty um, vast collection of different types, a uh, combination of hand hammers, um, uh, HHX, AAX, and uh, the new vault symbols, which I just started incorporating a little bit. This is a 21-inch uh, vintage hand hammer. Um, just a, a great crash. I like my crashes a little bit on the darker side. Um, this is a 20-inch, 22-inch uh, prototype. Um, it's a symbol that they, uh, it, it was a prototype. I really liked the way it sounded, so they don't, um, uh, um, they don't produce them, but they make them for me since uh, we have a good relationship. Yeah, they, they keep making them for me and I love them. It's a perfect uh, crash ride. 18 inch uh, china. Um, I don't know what kind of china it is. Just the HHX Chinese. Um, I mostly use this uh, with a combination of a snare hit. So just a really uh, fast, loud sort of combination of a snare and crash. Um, right next to it, uh, I use a 20 inch vault. This is actually a brilliant finish. Um, the other crashes um, are just a regular finish. Um, this is just a great sounding cymbal. It's really fast, it's got a really bright sound, a little brighter than the other ones. Um, but yeah, I just, I just love the way this thing sounds. Uh, my ride cymbal, I use a 21 inch hand hammered dry bell ride. Um, again, this is just a normal finish. Uh, the bell's not too big on it, but um, big enough. I do use the bell a lot. I um, actually ride I, when I'm playing hard. I, I do ride the, the the ride, so it's got a it's got a pretty decent wash to it too. Um, my hi hats are 13 inch HHX uh, Evolution, and uh, I like a very crisp, um, fast sound. Um, I love these hi-hats, they're my favorite hi-hats I've ever played. Um, they're super fast, super crisp, and um, you know, they sound pretty full too. Um, they're not as thin as some people might think because of the small diameter.